And this is the question from the gate 2022 uh, set two. Question number 50 for the technical part and the question 16 the overall set. So it is the from the charging of the tank problem. And here uh, it is the uh, here uh, along with the charging of tank heat tra heat transfer is also going from the simultaneously from the tank. So we have to find the final temperature. Let this is the pipeline and uh, this is the uh, wall. This is the tank. This is our control volume. So, volume of the tank is given as 8 meter cube. And uh, it's completely evacuated initially. Uh, so, initially, wall which closed and tank is assumed to be completely evacuated. The air pressure and temperature inside the pipeline is maintained at 600 kPa and 306 Kelvin. So, here uh, pressure is 600 kPa and uh, temperature is 306 Kelvin. So filling the tank begins and uh, the uh, process ends when the pressure inside this same as the pipeline. And the uh, during the filling process heat loss to the surrounding is 1000 kJ. Here uh, heat loss is happening 1000 kJ. The specific heat of the air uh, given final temperature of the tank at the end of the process that we have to find so we have to first do the mass balance in the control volume change in uh, rate of change of mass inside the control volume would be mass inlet mass rate of mass of inlet minus exit mass so if there is no exit so it would be zero and uh, now coming to the uh, energy balance of control volume so the rate of change of internal energy of the control volume would be equal to the uh, so how much energy is, com in, is in coming to the system like uh, incoming mass and in, uh, in enthalpy associated with that mm. and plus let's suppose some amount of heat is added so that is the Q and let's suppose the work is done by the system is QW and uh, the enthalpy exit by the mass is this so these two are zero here because no mass is exit going out of the system and no work is done by the system so this is the and now we are doing the for whole time frame uh, so change of enthalpy internal energy of the control volume is uh, u2 minus u1 but u1 is zero here because no mass is already there and uh, this is the mass in total mass coming into the system so it would be the mass same as the enthalpy here uh, sorry internal energy here so m dot i and uh, this hi would be the cp and initial temperature so hi and this q is going out of the system so it would be the minus uh, minus thousand now what will be the u2 m dot i and uh, cv and T2 final temperature and what would be this m dot i cp and uh, uh, initial temperature here could be cause a h i initial what what would be the coming this temperature is coming so initial minus thousand so what is the m dot i uh, how much mass uh, has been coming to the system it would be the pv by rt2 so p would be the 600 and uh, v would be the 8 meter cube 0.287 and T2. So we will put this Mi here and Cv already know Cv is the 0.718 and T2 is T2 we have to find and uh, all values we are going to put now. So here we will put uh, 600 into 8 by 0.287 T2 into CV is 0.718 and T2. This T2 T2 will go on. This is the first term. This would be equal to the uh, same. Now we have again put 600 into 8 by 0 0.287 into T2 and uh, 1.005. This CP we are going this this I am going to write into uh, ti is 306 and minus 1000 
so here only now uh, t2 is the variable here and uh, other all other values are known so we can easily solve it uh, so k2 will become 395.388 kelvin so this is the charging of tank problem other charging of tank problem we can easily get uh, so for the more detailed information we can go for the NPTEL, sex, uh, NPTEL lectures for the same and the by, given by the professor sk so uh, available in the NPTEL. thank you